Hey everybody, Jimmy is Promo here, and in this video, we're going to talk about the OK Google detection um, in case if there was a possible issue with the detection working on your phone. So if you're watching this video, either you're curious to see what I'm talking about, or you're watching this video because right now your detection is not working on your Samsung Galaxy device. And maybe possibly the reason is because very recently you have updated your Samsung Galaxy device up to Android Nougat. And a lot of times when you do updates with little operating systems, there will be a little bit of data that's kind of stored. And I will say they're in limbo in between each update. And there's that storage that doesn't really know what to do. So it simply just causes small little issues. Now, it could happen to any Android phone. Shoot, it can even happen to iPhones, but these Samsung phones are extremely easy to fix. So some of you guys probably tried to go back into your little Google search bar. You click that little G, you went into these settings on the top left-hand side, and you hit on settings. This is where your voice detection is at. And right there is where it says, OK, Google. So, <laughs> which I'm going to try not to say that again. Once you go inside of that detection, maybe possibly one of these is grayed out. Uh, maybe you tried to retrain your voice and it just does not work. So this is where you'd be able to um, correct it. You go in the very top right hand side and you click on that settings icon. Inside of there, you go to apps. And inside of apps, you want to find that Google app. And once you find that, this is where you would actually um, delete some of that little stored information that was in between the updates. So let's go to Google app and then you want to go into memory. Actually, you know what? Let's go into storage. Once you go inside of storage, this is where you clear the cache. And if you wanted to as well, you can even go into manage storage. So if you have an option that is to um, clear data as well as clear the cache, make sure you guys go do that. Once you've done that, you click on the Google search bar, and then this is where you'd be able to click on that Google on the very top left-hand side, click on the settings, and then you go into the settings right there one more time, and click on voice. Now inside of voice, you go back to that OK Google detection, and you can see that once I said OK Google, it does not detect the phone. It's because that I have actually taken off my little voice. So now this is where you go into and turn it right back on. We'll go to continue, and this is where you say, OK, Google. OK, Google. OK, Google. You say that three different times. You hit yes, I'm in. You're going to type in your either your fingerprint or also your pin. So I'll just do fingerprint. And now everything is actually all set right back up. And I'd be able to go pretty much into any screen and I'd be able to say, OK, Google. And then now I'm able to tell my phone what I want it to do, play a song, navigate me somewhere or whatever the case. Hey, if you guys found this video to be helpful, make sure you guys do a good turn daily and pay it forward and also hit on the subscribe button on the very bottom left hand side. And then on the very bottom right hand side, you guys will be able to check out the very next video. And right above that is the playlist for the Samsung Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus. See you guys later.